G'day guys, welcome back to my channel and um, today I've got some some um, copper ore and um, there is gold in it apparently but it's mainly a copper ore that I picked up oh, probably about 18 months ago now when I was down south at a, um, a copper, it's a copper and gold field where I picked them up from so I've got a few pieces here And I'm going to crush them and pan them out and see if I can get any gold out of this out of this material. I'll just bring this around to give you a better look. <coughs> Excuse me. You can see you can see the green malachite in the rock. That there's um there's some quartz in amongst it. Quartz with a malachite staining. This big munker chunk. Yeah. So that's what I'm going to do today, guys. I'm just going to break all this down into smaller pieces, and and I'll run it through my big crusher, and then pan it out, and we'll see what we get. Okay. I'll get back to you. Okay. We're crushing. Okay, pan number one. There it is, crushed up nice and fine. So um, yeah, we'll see what we get out of this material. It's uh, like I said, it's it's come from a, a copper mine, but there there was um, gold as well. It's more copper than gold, apparently. But anyway, we'll see if we can get any any gold out of this material. It's just stuff that I've had lying around the shed. So I thought I'd, uh, I'd crush it up, pan it out and show you guys, see if we get anything. Yeah, it's, it's a, um, a copper mine, I was always going to go back down there, maybe I will one day, um, take some holidays and and go down there and, and uh, yeah, and maybe do some more, take some more, some more samples. Okay guys, let's have a look. Let's see if we can get any gold out of this material. I can see all the sulfides. All that goldy, glittery stuff there. That's all. All the um, sulfides. Can't see any gold. Maybe I'll have to hang on to the sulfides and um, roast them. Oh, that might be one piece of gold. Oh yeah, it is. Where is he? There's one tiny little speck. There it is there. See there guys? In front of my finger. One little speck of gold. Yeah. But uh, I might um I might keep all this sulfites and uh, yeah and I'll roast them on another another time. Yeah. I'm sure if I looked under here in my jeweler's loop I'd see some fine gold. Yeah. Anyway, I'll get back to you with another pan. 
Okay, pan number three. And uh, yeah, it's mainly sulfides, guys, and there is gold in it. Um, there's that piece that I showed you that was in the pan. That's probably the biggest piece I've seen. Um, the rest of it I can see with a, with a jeweler's loop. It's really super fine gold. Yeah, so what I'll do, I'll keep all this sulfides and I'll, I'll roast it all and see if I can get some gold out of it. Won't be much, but oh, if I... Um, in my travels, if I get more sulfides, I'll wait until I've got a, oh, I don't know, half a kilo or so, a kilo, and then I'll, um, I'll smelt it all down and uh, recover the gold. I'll be going out bush later this week. Um, I still haven't decided what I'm going to do yet. But, uh, I will get out there and and have a bit of a prospect, I think. I've got a few areas I want to go and check out. Yeah. Okay, guys, let's have a look. Yeah, at all the sulfides. Millions and millions of sulfides. No doubt there'd be gold locked up in those sulfides. But I can't see I can't see any decent specs of gold. It's just all um the gold that's in there is super fine. And uh yeah and and it's uh, mainly sulfides in this material. Okay guys, I'll keep going. There's another piece of gold guys, just there in front of my finger. I hope you can see it. Just there. Yeah, that was in the very next pan. Okay guys, I'll get back to you. Okay, pan number six. And the last pan. And yeah. Um, getting getting fine gold in every pan, guys. So, so there is gold in this material. Very fine, though. It's not not real big big gold. But I suppose if you get enough of it, it'll all add up. You just got to, um, like I was saying, with those sulfides, they got to be roasted and smelted to get the gold. Yeah. Oh, I'll, uh, maybe I'll make another video up on that roasting the sulfides and smelting the roasted sulfides to um, recover the, the gold. Yeah. Maybe I might be able to get a small bead out of it. What I'll do, um, what's in this pan, I'll run my microscope over it and just to show you the gold, the fine gold. Righto, let's have a look. Maybe we might get lucky and get a big, big piece. Can't see any. Just heaps and heaps of sulfides. Heaps and heaps of sulfides, guys. That's it. Yeah. And just like I said, that fine gold that sort of hangs up the back here. Yeah. Okay. I'll um. I'll catch us at the wrap up. That was um, just something a little bit different. Um, doing doing some old, crushing up some old rocks and stuff that I had in the shed. Yeah, uh, copper ore. But there was gold in it. Um, I think 
if I had a 20 litre bucket full of that stuff, I think, uh, yeah, I might get a gram, gram or so out of it. Going by the amount of fine gold that was in there, I mean, a lot of it was super fine that you needed a, um, a, a jeweler's loop to, to see it in the pan. But there was a lot of it. There was a lot of specks of, of gold that's just super fine. And the odd speck that you could see with the, with the naked eye. Yeah. Anyway, um, that's, that's all I was going to show you guys um, on this video, uh, just a quick one. Um, congratulations Kevin, um, Gold Hunter 77 yeah, I, I've sent your silver coins off mate, I posted them off this morning, you should get them, I, you'll get them before Christmas Day anyway, so um, yeah, good luck with those and I'll put in a few extra bits and pieces for you mate yeah okay um cheers i hope to get out the bush this week sometime and um i'm not sure what i'm going to be doing i've got a couple of old gold mines to check out and there's also a place where I'll, i've been to before where i use my metal detector and I found a, um, I found a, a gold and copper specimen when I, when I, with my um, Monster 1000 metal detector. So I was thinking about going back there um, because that was a couple of years ago now and I haven't been back. So I might go there. There's a big waterfall there, big rock waterfall and um, all these quartz, quartzy, quartzite rocks scattered everywhere. So I might go back there and get that a a bit of a going over and see if I can find some more specimens. Yeah. Okay, guys. That's it. Thanks for watching and supporting my channel. I hope you like my new intro. Um, I'll go with that for a while. I might change it up later on down the track. Yeah. Okay, guys. Be good. Stay safe. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye.